Charles Oakley, who, who people say probably is the toughest player and the toughest person to ever come through the NBA. But guess what? In the waning, draining final days of another Knicks lost winter, Madison Square Garden security ejected former Knicks player and eternal Knicks legend Charles Oakley as Oakley was seated near the franchise owner James Dolan. James Dolan has come out and said, hey, look, from the moment that Charles Oakley walked into Madison Square Garden, he appeared to be impaired and he was verbally and physically abusive towards people. Uh, I've seen this a long time ago, and I... And them seeing it, you know, Spike probably when I got thrown out, them guys just did something over their own. Somebody told them to. The guys I played with, that's what I'm hurt about, you know, because they know I had a back all the time, every day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. And they can't say nothing. It's Charles Oakley over there, Mike. Mike Hinton stands. Charles Oakley is involved in something. They need security in big ways. There's a he said and a he said. On the other hand, I tend to believe James Dolan. And it's not unfair. Here's the reason. Who has more to lose by telling a lie? You can't say we have it all on film, whereas all Charles Oakley has is his word. Hey, man, I gave my word. I didn't do nothing to nobody about nothing. Hey, guys, walk up on me. I was on there four and a half minutes. And this is really bad for basketball. I think when I played in the game for a decade, played with my heart, soul, every night on the court. I was consistent my whole career, my whole life, and you know, that's what people respect for people. My body work being consistent. Oh, smash! Yo, because I play games out here. Look, your security shoot. He was like, nah, I think he did a long time. Yo. I feel like that's not the first time they've missed him in Charleston. Oh, probably not. Yeah, no. Yo, yo! Yo, 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 I was speaking the truth. I mean, anything bad about me, I did. Even though that's not my character, I'm just a guy that doesn't take no trash. I'm for what's right. It ain't about money. I don't care what he got. What he did was wrong. And it, if he, it's bad, he could have called a ride if he want. He could have called a ride. So what did you say to him? That's the one part of the story that said nothing you to said him. You said nothing to him. Nothing Joe. to him. Anything to anyone around him. He tried. Nothing. I was only in there for four minutes. the Chicago Bulls too. You know, you take a couple of clips, you you take a couple of movie clips and then you put some words around it. I'm not no. trying to disrespect you. And... <coughs> huh? I didn't hear what you said. Huh? What you say? DeAndre! You can't talk now, huh? Huh? Are you okay? 